Kiwi says nature doesn't have fun. Even in Bukina Tuk in, uh, in Pumalanga province, South Africa, home of the spirit courts. Now, in this case, um, I work on a rough estimation that the, the core of this material would perhaps be Chalcedony. And uh, so the underlying form would be that of Chalcedony, uh, perhaps botryoidal or a little bit of a autistic abstract botryoidal. And this has been coated by a layer of druzy quartz. Now you'll see some reddishness to brownishness in, uh, that's a little bit underexposed, in some of these sections. And that would most likely be a, a thin layer of perhaps hematite or girthite sitting on top of the uh, Chalcedony before it's been uh, coated by a layer of druzy quartz crystals. Very, uh, actually a lot of fun, these guys. Just the, just the form is so abstract, so different. Full of bling bling, can be displayed uh, on various aspects. Um, one could have it like this, for instance, where you have the, there's an underlying form over there. Crust runs right across, right through. No really prominent crystals. They're all pretty much the same size, the small little druzy crystal sitting on the matrix. You could have it going like this, where we look into that section of the vac. So various aspects. The matrix, the natural matrix, would be going around like that. So let's take it on that. Take it across like that. Looking from the top down, you'd have this effect. Quite, quite lovely. All the way from South Africa. Book and out, hook and surround. Spirit quartz with a difference. <coughs> Maybe uh, Chalcedonic spirit quartz, perhaps. Coin a new name.